sub guys here we are in a new video this might be our last video in this studio anyway as i was saying sub guys here we are in a new video and this video i'm going to show you how to do instagram whatsapp facebook and twitter and countries like china because they are banned and blocked there so you can't access these social media platforms for example countries like china turkey vietnam Iran, Bangladesh, North Korea, and Uganda. All these countries have blocked social media. So let's say you just visit one of these countries and want to use WhatsApp, Instagram, Twitter, or Facebook. You can't use them there. And I'm sure you need to contact your friends and family, most especially using WhatsApp or Instagram. And China have officially blocked WhatsApp, Twitter, and Instagram there, and also Facebook too. They blocked this social media platform since 2014. So after going to one of these countries, if you are a visitor, I'm sure you don't know what to do. But they did not just block these social media platforms. They also have their own social media platforms like this as an alternative for the Twitter, Instagram and so on. But that isn't important to you because the people you want to talk to are not on the China social media platforms. They are on the ordinary social media platforms like WhatsApp, Instagram, Twitter and so on. So what you need to change is your VPN. To access those WhatsApp, Instagram, Twitter in China, you have to change your VPN. Because when you look at it, you'll see there are only 15% of Chinese people on Instagram, Twitter and so on. Maybe they are not living in China. Maybe they are living in other countries where all those social media platforms are not banned. And it's not just China where these social media platforms are banned. These are a lot of countries where all those Twitter, Instagram, WhatsApp and Facebook are banned. So you can't use them there. But there's a way to use them even though if you are in these countries. So changing your VPN is simple even if you are using an Android device or an iOS device. You just need to go to App Store. After going to App Store, I recommend this app. Just search Turbo VPN. This is the one up here. So after tapping it, you are going to see this app. Already I have downloaded mine. So just open it. So it will load for some few seconds. This is a very good app I recommend you using there because this is one I'm using and I really enjoy using it. So it's going to load for some seconds. So you are going to tap on this carrot you see right here. So it's, it's going to connect in some few seconds. Oh yeah, here we are. It's already connected. So you have automatically changed your VPN. So you are just going to tap on the app you want to use if it's WhatsApp, Instagram or Twitter. And it's going to work just like you are living in a country where that isn't banned or blocked. And also you can go and turn off the VPN from your settings. Just go to your settings and then VPN, turn it off. Or if you want to use it, you can turn it on without visiting the app. And that's also amazing. So let's just keep mine off. So you have already seen how you can use VPN to use all those social media apps like Instagram, Twitter, and so on. So you can use them even if you are in China or all those countries where all the social media platforms are banned. So the thing that surprised me the most is that China doesn't use Google to search as a search engine. They use Baidu. And as a WhatsApp alternative, they use the app WeChat. So we won't say it's a bad thing that they blocked all these social media platforms. They have their own reasons and it's their country. So this video is just for someone who visits any of these countries that are not using all these social media platforms. You can use the VPN thing and you can access all the social media platforms you want to. And I think that's much of it. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe for more videos like this. Until then, I'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace.